Thanks for stopping by to see what I'm up to today. I have promised an update on my work with the Hobby PCB Hard Rock 50 amp. Here it is. Actually, right now, here's the ATU, and I haven't had to do a lot of work with this. I've only had, it comes pre-assembled. I've only had to add a couple of uh, SMA connectors with RG316. So the ATU sits in the bottom of the amp enclosure held firmly with a couple of standoffs. As well, it's designed to fit perfectly in the extruded slots of the enclosure. Comes pre-assembled, it's ready to go. Most of the work is on the main board. Here's a picture of the main board. 85% of the kit comes prefabricated. You might have to connect a couple of boards, wrap some toroids. I believe there are 16 toroids. Let's take a look at the front of the unit. The Hard Rock 50 unit comes with an extruded aluminum case, a big rock and heat sink, nice screen printing, nice LCD. I believe it's a color screen. I haven't turned mine on yet. But here's a view from the side. And the other side, bore ring. We'll show the back panel in a little bit. But this, pin, this panel is pretty big and wide open, easy to work on. Wrapping the toroids, stripping the enamel wire, and getting them soldered to the board following the clear instructions won't be any problem for anyone. There are 14 toroids with plenty of provided wire. The instructions are very clear, but I got fast and loose with that number 22 enamel wire the way I get fast and loose with exclamation points on YouTube. And now I'm waiting on Amazon to show up with some number 22 enamel wire so I can get this project done. I'll tilt the piece a bit and you can now see the front board and that's where you connect the LCD and the LED. Quick look at the back completes the geometry of the box and you do have to connect a board here which connects the USB PTT accessory 9 pin connector and power cable. And of course, the UHF connectors for signal in and signal out. Thanks for stopping by.